Hi there. Today I got a product that I'm going to test for next couple of days. This is going to help me on my road trips. Let's get into it. So this is a KWC4 C Cook Classic Cooler. So this is going to be a bottle cooler or a can cooler. Let's open it and see what it is. So there you have it. It's a Coca-Cola Classic Thermoelectric Cooler. So this has a 12 volts and a household outlet cable. So let's see how this is going to perform. So it says it's going to support six cans. So I don't use cans, I use bottles. So I'm going to see if a bottle water bottle fit in this. It's a little smaller than I expected. Right, there's a fan behind this cooler. There's a off and a cold switch. This is a DC 12 volt plug and this is AC 120 volts outlet or inlet. On the sides there is some vents for the heat sink. This side also I see a heat sink. So let's get the size. So from outside, so it's about 10 inches tall. And about seven inches wide. A user manual, got the cables, all right this is the 120 volts cable. And the 12 volts cable that goes into the 12 volts outlet. There's a divider. Let's check the measurements inside. So inside it's about 8 inches tall and about 5.5 inches wide. And again 5.5 inches deep. Let's see if this cooler fits this great value drinking water bottle, this is a 16.9 fluid ounce water bottle. Yep, it fits all right. I guess it would work. I think you might be able to fit four bottles inside. 
without the divider. Let's plug in and see how this cooler works. Since I'm not sure, I'm not going to tie it permanently to the car. I'm just going to leave it uh, on the side of my tools box and see how it's going to perform. I'm going to do two tests. First, I'm going to plug this in to the 12 volts outlet and see how good this cooler is to see how much cooler it can get inside with the 12 volts driving around. And then I'm going to plug in to the household outlet and see what's the best this cooler can do. All right, according to the instructions, this thermoelectric unit is designed to be a portable storage container for cold drinks and cold food. It can chill approximately 32 Fahrenheit or 18 degrees centigrade below ampere temperature. Okay. Operation, operating instructions plug into power source in the car use the 12 volt power cord move the sliding switch to DC when using 12 volt power cord hmm. I see the on off and cold switch and I see the 12 volt plug and 120 volt plug I don't see a um, sliding switch to DC when using 12 volt power cord or AC when using 120 volt power cord anyway we'll see that's all I can see. Off and cold switch and a 12 volt plug and a 120 volt plug. <laughs> I see the fan starting it's pretty quiet not bad pretty quiet oh I see this back panel is getting colder I guess that's where it starts getting cold yeah it's getting cold so let me run this for a while I'm gonna use this thermometer right now it's 88 degrees outside I'm gonna drive around for some time and see how this is gonna perform
So there you have the results. So inside the car, I was able to get down to 63, 63 degrees about four hours of driving. At home, I was able to get down to 54 degrees Fahrenheit in about six hours. So I think for a cooler, for $25 from Walmart, I don't think it's a bad idea, especially when you are out and having to have a cold drink of water. Wow. I think it's a good deal. Tell me what you think about it. Thanks for watching.